All right, in this lesson, let's talk about the different components of the SQL Server Database Engine. So at the core of the SQL Server Database Engine are two major parts. We've got the Storage Engine and the Query Processor, which is also called the Relational Engine. The Storage Engine is responsible for reading data between the disk and memory in a manner that optimizes concurrency while maintaining data integrity. The Query Processor accepts all queries submitted to SQL Server, devises a plan, for their optimal execution, and then executes that plan and then delivers the required results. Queries are submitted to SQL Server using Microsoft's flavor of SQL called Transact SQL. For each query it receives, the first job of the query processor is to devise a plan as quickly as possible, which describes the best possible way to execute that query, not the perfect way in order to arrive at what it believes is the best plan for executing that query. Now we're going to talk a little bit about the steps in the upcoming lecture, but they are parsing and binding, query optimization, and then query execution. 